is the New Testament. This was after the apostles. That's how people were receiving the Holy Spirit was through the holy oil. Now, in the Old Testament, how did they receive the Holy Spirit? The Holy Spirit, as we know it in the New Testament, wasn't the same um, as it wasn't is in, the in, in the Old Testament. But there were mm -hmm. something called uh, God's Spirit, mm -hmm. and uh, they said, for example, Samson and the Holy Spirit dwelt on him, and he break or done something very big miracles. And these spirits, God's spirits, it was from since ever. I mean. It didn't change, but uh, the the work of the Holy Spirit in the New Testament completely different from the Old Testament. So they didn't need the Holy Spirit like they needed it in the New Testament. In the New Testament, God wanted to give us a gift uh, and the communion of the Holy Spirit, but in the Old Testament, it, the people are not yet ready. To have the Holy Spirit, because He's the Holy Spirit is the Comforter. Yeah, and this is what Jesus said: "When I leave you, I will send you the Holy Spirit." Mm -hmm. He didn't say that in the Old Testament. He, in the Old Testament, the Holy Spirit always was with prophets, judges, mm -hmm. uh, something like that, uh, kings, but not the normal people. Now we are all the, have the Holy Spirit, but also. The Holy Spirit takes many shapes. One of the shapes that, uh, for example, for priests, completely different from the Holy Spirit from uh, the laymen mm -hmm. and uh, the Holy Spirit from the and the matrimony and uh, the Holy Spirit and the communion. baptism and the communion. Uh, everything the Holy Spirit take a shape to 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 have an act mm -hmm. and a specific sacrament. So if we, when we are wrong, we go to confession and we repent. So in a month, how many times should we be taking or going for confession? It's not about a month or two months. It's about you have um, the the old uh, the old church. The uh, uh, it was maximum forty days to, between two between confession. Every confession. Yeah, but uh, even if it is less than that or more than that, a little, no problem according to your uh, spiritual your father. Yeah. No, we need to confess every day actually. Okay, you mean you're <laughs> depending on your... The you time know, of yeah. your spiritual you father. You should always <laughs> be consistent, but let's say something extremely bad happens, you should go before your next meeting. Yeah, why you I'm saying... You shouldn't wait till your next meeting to confess. I'm saying go. why we are, we, we are, I'm think, th thinking that we are in need always. Always in need. If we can confess every day, we would do it. Mm -hmm. But of course, because it's uh, very difficult for, for us to, and for our spiritual father. To meet with us. Every, every day. On a daily, uh, daily basis, yeah.